Hi, it's your coach Joe Lucas. Welcome to your Practice Power Daily Coding video for Monday, the 23rd of September. Welcome to the last full week of the month of, of the third quarter. Hey, let me ask you a question. First off, I hope you had a great weekend. Is What are your client experience standards? So in other words, how your clients treat it, how they treat it when their phone's answered, how they treat it when they come in for reviews or you do it over the phone or you're doing it virtually. What do you do around their their personal birthdays? What do you do around their anniversary dates with you? You know, one of the strong strategies I really, really love, by the way, if you want to make, if you want to do something unique and different and kind of, because everybody does like, you know, birthday cards and, and nothing wrong with that, by the way. So I'm not saying, you know, ineffective. Uh, a lot of people do holiday cards. Some people do pre-holiday cards now. Some people do post-holiday cards, thank you cards, uh, thank, you know, Thanksgiving cards, fine. To me, one of the coolest things you can do is send your client a little something once a year on the anniversary, not of their wedding, but of when they hired you. Think about this. If you were to send a client a note, a card, a little gift, or take them out to lunch, whatever you want to do, or all of the above, right? And, and you were to say something like, hey, here's thanks for the last five years. Thanks for putting your trust in me. Thanks for putting your faith in me. Uh, whatever, right? Sign, advisor. First of all, I guarantee if you ask your clients right now, hey, when did you hire me? They can give you some concept. Maybe they can give you the month. Maybe maybe give you the month or the year. Some of them may have to like, if they've been around for a while, it's like, I don't know, forever, right? It has so much impact because it's a surprise to them. Hey, look, everybody knows when Christmas is or, or Hanukkah or the holidays or Thanksgiving or the when they, everybody knows when their birthday is, right? We all wake up, we don't forget, oh, it's my birthday today. They all forget the day they hired you. That's a very, see, you want to, that could, that could be a real strong differential to do that. And by the way, if you have clients that have other advisors, right? And, we, and a lot of times we have this situation. Imagine the gap you're going to create in the feeling of the relationship. When they get an answer, and when you send them an anniversary something, a card, a gift, a meal invitation, whatever, and their other advisors, they do nothing. In fact, they're, they're lucky they get a phone call for the review, right? It's a simple strategy that has profound impact, yet so few advisors do it. And, when I, and, and to me, it's stupid not to do it. So there's my challenge to you today, new week, right? Is And I know some of you are saying, well, Joe, you know, I've changed firms, and I've... You know what? Ballpark it. If you can't find the original account application, which by the way, if you can't find that, it would tell me there's something else wrong. Put an intern on it. Oh, I don't have time. Put your staff on it. Put a virtual assistant on it. Get a list. Put in your contact manager, anniversary date. Put a reminder for you and use it as a tremendous tool. Okay? Welcome to a new week. See you tomorrow.